Right, hello, and welcome back to the Classic Gamer X11 channel, and welcome back to some more One Shot Relic Challenge, this time on Crash Bandicoot 2. Now, the idea of the One Shot Relic Challenge is I attempt every level in the game trying to get a relic, and we'll see how many relics I end up with, and what flavour of relic. So, there's kind of the rubbishy sapphire, ugh, that's ugh, disgusting. Lovely gold, oh, mm. and then, oh, platinum. That's indulgence, that is. Right, let's start at Turtle Woods. First level in the game. And I do have the run ability already unlocked, as it would be a bit silly to do these levels without the run ability. Of course, in the original game, Crash didn't have the ability to run in Crash 2, but they added it in for Ed Saint Trilogy. Of course, I could have chosen to do any of the first five levels in the first warp room, but I might as well start at level one. That's where you usually would start, isn't it? It makes more sense. People don't get confused that way. Oh my god, this box, I hate you so much! Ah well. I don't think I'm going to get platinum now. That's probably out of reach already. If I spend about the five seconds trying to get a two second box. Hey, you made that jump. So you can make all of these free j No, I've, I've now belly flopped for no reason. Oh, this is going to Oh, this is back to normal. Oh, he's made that jump as well. Is this still even gold? I think it will be at least, surely. Oh, 48 free. That's, that's gold, surely. Hey. Despite belly flopping by mistake, and despite failing to make one of the jumps as well, and spending about five seconds getting that two second box, I still got a gold. I think the gold times are quite lenient. But hopefully you're enjoying this. I'm having a lot of fun. I'm having more fun than the time you play Monopoly. Oh, that's good times, isn't it? You know the game where you shove hotels up your bum? Oh. I always win at that game. Oh, I don't want to care about your dance. Snow go! Let's not go to snow go. Now, this is probably one of the hardest platinum relics in the game, so don't expect too much from here. I think all of the actual snow levels are among the hardest to get platinum relics. I've still not got all platinum relics, and it took me bloody ages to get snow go on platinum. Avoid the penguins! Ah, it's this. Oh, that was... I'm stuck! <laughs> that was mostly alright until I got stuck. Oh, seals, you bastards! No, Nitro! Don't jump up and smash me in the face! Of course, Nitro was the... F in Crash 2 was the first time they introduced Nitro, but in the original games, they didn't used to bounce up and smash you over... Oh, wait. Wasn't meant to jump on that seal, but this is alright. Should be able to run underneath all that. I've completely messed that up. Oh! I don't know how hard this is to talk and try and do relics. It's, it's bloody hard for me. I could barely do one thing at once. Let alone two and three. That's unbelievable. Ah! Oh! Is this gold? I think this could be gold. It was a bit, a bit messy, that one. That was a bit of a mess. Is it gold? It's gold still. It's, it's still gold. I mean, I shouldn't fail any of these first levels, really. I should get gold on all of the first five. And I probably do maybe, like, round five levels per episode. You could call it an episode. You could call it many things. You could call it a load of rubbish. But that would be mean. Don't call it a load of rubbish. I try my best. Oh, lovely gold. All right, skip the dance. We've already seen it before. All right, hang eight. Hmm, I could be risky on this one. I could try and do some of the risky jumps. I do like a good risk. I once bet... Five pounds on England to beat San Marino in football. 
Oh, that was, that was a bit of a risk for me, though. You know, San Marino, they're a good tea, they are. So you got to get used to the slide jump spin on this. Because I'll be using it quite a bit. Oh, flipping almost messed that completely up. Also, you probably can hear my controller, but the way I've got my, you know, mic... Oh, I've gone the wrong way. I was meant to go to the right. The way I've got my microphone set up, it's quite hard to change the audio settings so you can't hear my controller. First then you can't hear me, I've noticed. Oops, I've been smashed by a plant. That was actually a big mistake. Still alive though, still alive. I could still get gold at least. But I did want that Aku left. Having that Aku gone is I'd be quite annoying. I've been annoyed now. Actually, no, I don't. This is this level. This one's easy. I don't need Akus on this one. What is this? Is this gold or platinum? I was probably nowhere near platinum, was I? Oh, it is platinum. Oh, lovely. Ah, at least I've got one. At least I've got one platinum during this run. I would have been very disappointed if I didn't get a single platinum. But anyway, I've, I've started to show that I'm actually relatively decent at the game. Because in Crash 1, I, I died quite a bit on the first few levels. Of course, Crash 2, it's a bit easier than Crash 1. Although, since I've been speedrunning Crash 1, I've learned quite a bit more about the game. And I think if I was to do another one-shot relic challenge on Crash 1, I think I'd get maybe like at least somewhere around... 18 to 20 relics rather than about 12 right the pits the pits the don't really know this one too well i think the platinum's quite hard to get so i'll mostly be going for gold of course i could be killed by a turtle straight away oh lovely smashing news that was oh i've been smashed so I'm not going to get the third Aku and I probably might die. I think those birds are harder on this game. They seem to have a different way of hit. Yeah, what am I doing? I'm all over the place. Left? Is left quicker? I don't know. I can't remember. It's been so long since I've attempted this relic. I can't remember what way I went. <laughs> Oh, that still hit me, did it? Okay. Oh, <laughs> oh, this is getting risky. I'm risking too much. And it's not even worth a biscuit, let alone a relic. I'd rather have a biscuit than a relic anyway. Much more delicious. Oh, oh I still made that. That's the thing. With, when you make those jumps, the camera doesn't quite... Doesn't quite reconfigure itself quickly. Can I make three or three? Oh, I can. Oh, I almost got stuck on the thing. Is this gold at least? Oh! Gold! Even though I messed it up quite a lot there. That's four relics out of four. Unbelievable seeds. I'm so excited, I might do another backflip. Here I go. <laughs> Did it. Nah, I was only joking though. I, I can't do a back flip. I can't even do a front flip. I can barely do a forward roll. Right. Crash dash. This is definitely going to be the hardest of the five. Because of the amount of reaction speed you need for these type of levels. And, you know, the stupid mines that have been misplaced all over the place. Oh. Who put all those mines there, the bastard? So yeah, this one could be difficult. <laughs> I completely forgot where the actual timer was there. I almost ran right by it. Oh well, that's a good start. Oh, there, oh, see? You've got to have such good reaction speeds. You, most of the time you just don't have a chance. So I'm probably gonna die. See, unless you know that's there, you can't avoid it. Just one of life's hard, hard challenges, isn't it? Trying to avoid mines while you're running away from a boulder. Happens to me all the time. 
I believe some of that sentence made some sense. Occasionally I do make sense. I think. Do I? Maybe. Oh, run, crash, run. Run, run, run as fast as you can. You can't catch me. I'm the Brin Brinjabred Bram. <laughs> well, I messed that up, didn't I? Oh. I've messed that up as well. See? So that's what happens when you fail a relic. So, I guess that will end the first episode with four relics, three of them delicious gold, one of them delectable platinum, and one failure. I take that, I take that though. So, thank you everybody for watching. Goodbye, take care, and have a nice day.